this video, I want to demonstrate how to use the simple arc between elements command in Open Roads Designer. This command can be found under the Open Roads modeling workflow, under geometry, and under horizontal. If you go to the arcs, click on that and arc between elements, and you'll see the simple arc command. So I want to access this tool. And if you look at the uh, the bottom left of the screen, it says locate the first element. So I have drawn two tangents in here, and I want to create an arc between the two of them. So I'll locate the first element here in data point it to accept, and locate the second element here in data point to accept that. Now, I'm prompted either to dynamically um, place a radius here. Alternatively, I can key in a radius, um, and that's what I'm going to do here. I want to key in a radius of 500 feet, and I'll hit enter to lock in that value. And then I can either uh, place it where it is currently, or I can move it dynamically to place it somewhere else. Uh, in this case, I want to place it right here, and I'll data point to accept that. Then I get the option to trim and extend either both segments, none of the segments, the back segment, or the ahead segment. In this case, I want to trim and extend both, so I'll data point to accept that. And from there, <clears throat> A simple arc is created between these two elements. If you'll notice, this arc here has a feature definition, has no feature definition, um, and these two tangents have the feature definition of geom baseline. What I can go in and do now is complex this geometry. So I'll complex by element, and I want to do this automatically, and I want to give it all the same feature definition of geom baseline. Data point to accept that, and now we'll notice that this complex element has the feature definition of geom baseline. 